hello good day welcome to latest solution today we are going to be looking at a series on tutorial on how to convert video audio files we are going to be using different softwares to perform such tasks for the first tutorial on conversion i did on vlc but right now i'm going to be carrying out a tutorial using the total video converter the total video converter is a software made by effect matrix it's a shareware that means in order to get the license you need to pay so after installing the software and purchasing or you could use the trial copy to convert video or audio files you launch after installing you launch the total video converter as you can see mine is on my desktop the icon is on my desktop you launch it after you launch it you wait a little for the program to open the program requires administrative privileges so you click on yes or you could right click to open it and click on yes you could see that it's asking me for registration information but actually i haven't purchased a license so i will say i want to try it more but actually it's a great software that if you require it always you could really pay to have it if you are into lots of uh, video conversions or audio conversions so next is you click on this icon by the left hand side it says new tax this is where you are going to select what you want to convert so you click on new tax after you click on new tax you are going to select this and go to the location where the file you want to convert is for example this is my c drive i want to convert a file on my desktop so i'll go to users and click on team I'll click on user then click on go to my desktop whatsoever location the file you want to convert is you can just move to the location you can see that my is in the YouTube folder on my desktop so I open the folder so this is the YouTube file I select and click on open after I've clicked on open you could see that here present are different video formats these are pocket player formats for example if you want to convert for the PSP you could use for the Apple iPhone Zoom Xbox Blackberry and all cell phone you could select this if you want to convert and then burn into a CD you select this you want to convert and burn to a DVD and so on you want to convert and burn into a VCD you want to convert and burn into a audio CD you select this for the web for example if you want to put on youtube and all other video streaming sites you can use any of these formats if you want to convert for a video file there are different types of video files the 3gp the avi the mpeg the mkv and if you want to convert to an audio file select there are different formats of audio files and if you want to convert to for to HD videos and all these are the present place for HD video so mine I want to convert it to a 3GP file because I want to load it into a low end phone a future phone I want to load this tutorial into a future phone so I'll select 3GP there are three types of 3GP but I want it to be video so I'll select 3GP which will make it video so now after you've clicked on that you can go and select the location where you want the converted files to be default location is the program file total video converter converted folder but i want mine to be on the desktop so i'm going to browse i'm going to go to my c go to users click on users and select my desktop and click OK. 
you can see it's brought out this the default converted folder has changed so this is where your you just click on yes to save in the location you've selected then you now click i've selected this mp4 file to be converted to a 3gp file so all i just need to do right now is press convert now as you can see once i press convert now the old the video file will start converting to the 3gp file you can see it's converting this is the percentage moving if you want this process to take place in the background, you just cl click into this box and minimize. You see that it will be taking place in the background. You can still relaunch it. You can see the conversion process is a bit fast, it's very fast. You can pause the conversion process in case you might want to be doing other things. You can pause the conversion process. You could see on my desktop, this is the file being converted. You could see it's already saving. You could see it's in C users, user desktop, and it's present on my desktop computers. You can see it here. Actually, this is a very lovely tutorial and to help you in conversion of video files or audio files to different formats thanks for watching hope you, hope you get it if you have any question you can add back make sure to visit latersolution.com you we'll see the video has completely format is complete the format is completed and it will launch the location of the form the location so you could see this is the file that was converted Thanks for watching. Make sure you stay glued to watch other tutorials on video on conversion of files. Thanks for watching. Make sure you visit LaserSolution.com. Thank you.